For too long, I've been out of the fishing scene on Hypixel. Today is the day I return to my roots, because obviously everyone knows I'm a fishing YouTube channel, Bedwars on the side. So as you know, I uploaded my fishing guide of 2021 of catching every single fish. And of course, Hypixel always has to add new fish, and literally as soon as I uploaded that video, they added a new one. So uh, I kinda caught three more off camera. As you can see, it's currently the summer update, and for some reason they only added one new fish, and that was this one. However, recently on Hypixel, there's been something called Event Experience, and I literally have no idea what it is. If you head over to this NPC, and you click here, the Event Shop, there is a bunch of exclusive stuff that's apparently going to go away, so I'm probably going to try to max out the shop. But there's one thing in specific that caught my eye, the Fishing Pet. So I unlocked the Fishing Pet, and it's actually kind of cool. However, if you go over to the Fishing tab, you notice that there's two fish, the Puffer Fish. And it's a legendary, so obviously it's going to be hard to get. I looked through the shop for a decent amount of time and I couldn't actually find it, and then it hit me. It was probably a fishing reward. Now if you know anything about fishing rewards, you literally have to have no life in order to obtain them. But let's go over here and check. Oh, you, you, you need 2,500 fish to get it? That's nothing, right? Now normally I'd probably just like dedicate a week and like try to get it. Except I actually have like a trip coming up that I can't really play Minecraft on. Unless... Alright guys, so I actually bought this mag just so that way I could fish on the go. It's gonna be really helpful while I'm on my trip. And so I did just that. Alright guys, so I'm fishing on my Mac right now. I'm so happy I made this $1,000 purchase just so I could fish in Minecraft. Please subscribe. Anyway, before we get into the summer update, let me recap you on what happened in the Easter update. I believe last that we left off, I was way behind in fishing, however I infiltrated the Master Fishers Guild and I was able to get thousands more fish. I'm almost at 10,000, which means I can almost claim this reward. Last night, I wrote down the amount of fish that they had before I went to sleep. Oh my god, it changed. Wait. <gasps> Hold on. He's in this lobby. Wait, it's an open guild? Hold on. I'm in the guild. Hold on, let's see. How are you guys so good at fishing? It's all in the wrist. So the first thing that I tried to do in the Easter update was max out my fishing rod. As if you were some sort of amateur fisher that didn't know there was fishing rod upgrades, well there is. And there's still one more upgrade that I need, but it's probably going to be real on time before I get it, and honestly I don't even really need it. But something that I did need at the time was look at the C4. So during the Easter update, I fished a lot to try to get it, but then finally I unlocked it. Nice. Oh yeah, also back on the topic of infiltrating the guild. To be honest, I probably didn't even need to join the guild because on a different all I asked how did the master fisher get so many fish and this was the answer I received. They couldn't stop fishing. Anyway, that's pretty much all that happened during the Easter season, but I actually did end up back on the top 100, which is actually kind of cool. Oh yeah, and I also kind of got kicked out of the guild on my alt account after they found out what I was doing. But, there was someone in the guild named Otto Fisher, which is a little fishy. No pun intended, I actually genuinely said that without realizing that it was a pun. But I guess that guy actually got exposed and banned, so that's kind of cool. Anyway, we have like 700 fish to catch, so that way I could get to 10,000 fish and claim that reward. And then we have like another 1,000 fish to catch, so that way I could get the puffer fish pet. So let's get to fishing. After catching a thousand fish, I was able to unlock the portable pond gadget. Let's go check it out. So, I got the reward, and I got the portable pond gadget. Alright, here we go. Bruh. I caught a thousand fish for stone slabs and water. I'm gonna get back to fishing, because I'm getting close to ten thousand. Just a few more fish. Oh my, that was anticlimactic. Bro. Bro! <laughs> Let's go, dude. 10,000. Let's go, dude. Okay, so we got that, and we also got this to claim. So there's that. And we got this. Oh, what does that actually do? Ah, I see. It has, like, green particles. I caught 10,000 fish literally just for that. Oh my god. And I got 10,000 XP as well, so that's, I mean, it's an accomplishment, but they, the reward is really not worth it. <laughs> then what's this? Season Fishing Banner. Oh, okay, let's see. Season Fishing Banner. Alright, well that's cool. And now we just have like another thousand fish to catch. <laughs> ah, we're almost there. 
Yeah, honestly, the 10,000 fish reward is pretty underwhelming. That was originally going to be the main goal of today's video, but we still have a pufferfish pet to unlock. Oh yeah, and literally right before I was almost about to unlock the pufferfish pet, they added orbs of power. Is it just me or does that sound like a Clash of Clans ripoff? <laughs> Basically, these orbs are literally like fishing boss fights, if you will. At first, I didn't really know how to attack them because it just says to attack them. And I thought I did it, but it broke my fishing rod. So then I had the genius idea of hitting it with my fishing rod. It worked, I'm hecka smart. Originally I thought these were going to be some rare collectibles that are like actually meaningful, but apparently they're just to prevent people from AFK fishing, which actually makes a little bit of sense, but I still think it's kind of dumb. Anyway, now I have like a bunch of orbs to catch. I'm not catching the last two, man. I actually did catch one of the last two twice actually, but apparently it's immune from certain angles, which would have been really nice to know before catching it up. Twice. Anyway, after I did that, I finally fished to 11,000 fish. After a long grinding session of fishing, we finally unlocked the pufferfish pet. Alright, get out of here, Fish's Field. I'm gonna rename him to Nubert's Field. Alright, I don't need him anymore. Dude, I just caught 2,500 fish just for this. <laughs> Who needs that stupid ass fish pet when you got heck a cool puffer fish pet? Anyway, I think that's going to conclude today's video. I'm so done with fishing. I would try to catch all the orbs, but maybe that could be a different video. Because honestly, making these fishing videos are a lot of fun. I'll probably make another follow-up video when there's more holiday updates, because there's really not much of a reason to fish when there's not a holiday update around. Anyway guys, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys all later. Bye-bye. Peace out.